What's up dudes, Max here. Wanted to make a quick video because something kind of unexpected popped up today that I don't think anybody was ready for. Some of you guys might remember back during EVO, the Fighting EX Layer guys had an announcement which was probably the biggest announcement of that show in my personal opinion. As far as like surprises and overall like, whoa, this is actually happening. Terry Bogard is going to be in Fighting EX Layer at some point, which is pretty damn cool. I'm also hearing at some point today as well, there was an announcement or a hint or a rumor of some kind that Fighting EX Layer is going to be coming to PC, which is extremely good news for that game. And the little bit and more that I've played of it ever since the new characters, it just keeps getting better and better. So, the fact that that's happening is great. The fact that Terry is showing up in Fighting EX Layer is really cool and potentially a PC version. But this video is actually about SNK heroines because it turns out that Terry being in Fighting EX Layer, Terry also being in SNK heroines was a tie-in of some kind for another character from famous Fighting EX Layer, classic Street Fighter EX fashion to show up as a character in SNK Heroines. I already know who it is. Skullamania. Let's see how hot you look. I never thought I'd say that. Oh, Skullamania, they're gonna do you dirty. Oh, this poor guy, he has no idea what he's in for. The alternate costumes, oh no. Alright. Alright. Then how far is SNK and Arika willing to go on these crossovers? Oh! Oh, he's just, he, he's just got boobs! I mean, I mean, that was kind of what they did to Terry. <laughs> I don't mind his, I mean, uh, her voice. Skullamania is now a girl. Whoa, Skull of Dream actually turns into a dream sequence. Wow, this, uh, this trailer is fantastic. Oh, nothing was at the dinner table. No one was being served a delicious dish. <laughs> He's like, what happened to my body? I just want to sell cars. Can't say I was expecting that. Uh, the age of crossovers, that's a crossover that I definitely never thought I would see, where Skullamania is eventually going to turn into a female and then appear into an all SNK girl fighting game. I, I didn't even get a chance to talk much about SNK Heroines. We played it a bit on the channel. I think the game's like cute. It has some interesting mechanics. I think one of the best aspects of the game is absolutely it's four player mode where all people get to control a character at the same time. I love that stuff. And uh, I want to see it included in more games. Dragon Ball Fighters just got it on the Switch. But um, there's some stuff in SNK Heroines based mechanics that I'm just not really a huge fan of. Uh, I kind of wish it played a lot more like KOF 14 because I really like playing KOF 14 and I love that game's combo system and its neutral and its movement and everything like that. Uh, but I'm definitely going to be checking this out. I know there's supposed to be a bunch of characters for this game. It seems like there's supposed to be a lot of extra characters they're going to add over time to SNK Heroines. I'm just curious, who else are they going to pull from whatever other franchise and then eventually femaleize them? Girlify them? So far they're doing a pretty good job with Terry and Skullamania. They're making headlines with that stuff, but uh, I think we're in an interesting age of crossover fighters right now, where these companies are taking characters from other things and just throwing them in there and blowing everybody's mind. I like that, and I'm hoping this goes in even crazier directions in the future. Samurai Showdown, I'm looking at you. As always, dudes, thank you a ton for watching. I'll be back with more updates, and I'll be checking this out when it does come out for SNK Heroines. My name is Max, and I'll see you next time.